This season is sponsored by Let's Pick. The app where you can enter and play customized contest about anything. Make sure to download Let's Pick right after this episode and follow them on social media to participate in weekly sequester contests. You can enter to win awesome prizes like sequester merch, gift cards, and a chance at the grand prize of $1,000 that one of you will take home on finale night. It's all happening on Let's Pick. Previously on Sequester. At the first elimination, a guy's alliance was exposed. I know there's a guy's alliance. I know who's involved in it. However, Kimberly did not succeed in her attempt to dismember them with her battle match selections. Your final score is 30. Congratulations, Drew. You have won this battle match and will return to the game. Later on, the guy's alliance was further exposed by one of their own. They have that's what they I have thought. branches, mm-hmm. and when we talk, it's them branching to get numbers. Which ultimately led to Matt being targeted. Yeah, so with Thomas, I'm, I'm pretty disappointed in him. We, we pretty much had a deal within the first few hours. Before elimination, Jessica made a move to stir the pot. I saw Wes get the LOS, and there's all this drama because some people think Wes had it, some people think Matt had it. I promise yeah, me yeah, he'll go back to him, I swear yeah, to God. Yeah, Kevin, yeah, I know, Kevin, Kevin right. sat down with us and he was like, he has it. Well, You're an angel, thank you so much. Then, it all came to a head at elimination. Motherfucker, I knew you had it. I mean, you left it lighting up in your pocket. It's in my pocket. It was, it's and a- I said, I saw it lighting up, so I don't say what the problem is. I called you out, I said, I you see seen it lighting up when it was You should have said something to me when you ain't had no fucking. None of that shit on your chest. Sorry, I got the thing got up the there and you didn't. Wait till the shit, wait till the shit happened. Bitch ass. And I'm gonna smoke you. Get that humble pie. Any. I did that, I'm not gonna lie. That that fight, that fight was me. I'm taking credit for it. Person eliminated is Matt. Matt? We're just talking. Yeah. I don't for anything as long as it's Don't, don't, don't. Expose the yeah, no, yeah. no. Oh, did you? Okay, okay. All right. Very interesting. Being as that may, um, I'm going to go ahead and honor uh, Jay West's request, and I'm going to pick Jay West and Kevin. I got the picture. You know why? Because you were the person in a room. <laughs> Hold on, let me just replay this in my head. That was fucking amazing. You literally said, "Yo, if you don't vote me, which I never voted you." Stop being scared. Come up here. Come get this. Let's go. Let's get this shit on the road, right? Let's go. Wasn't expecting that. That was a total shock. It's not good for me. Uh, I immediately started to see my game disintegrate with, you know, some of my strongest allies and Matt and then now in Kevin and then I'm a target. All these things are racing through my head and I don't know what the fuck to think and I'm thinking this game's going to be over like that before I know it. Let's have a battle of it. Here we go. I was expecting it. I knew it. Because Dina's out here running her mouth saying that I'm the one running the shit in the house. Oh, wait, me? Me? That's no, not true. <laughs> I did not sit there and say that Kevin was a threat. He was running the house whatsoever. I don't know how things got missed. Right. You know, I'm going to put out there too. My boy. They're trying to get me to turn on you so I get picked. Who is they? 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 Woo! Wait, oh, well, you ain't running me, bitch. I am not running no damn house. I'm not running a house. No, 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 you're gonna fuck me over. Wait, no, I'm not saying anything. Okay. And you were saying, I'm the one running the shit in the house, so I guess that's why I'm up here. Because obviously I'm looked at upon as a threat. Thank you. Very much thank you. I really needed that. <laughs> All right, so here we are. I just got thrown into this battle match. I'm honestly not surprised. I'm really anxious, 
nervous still, but I came here to compete. I'm an ultimate competitor. I feel like nobody really fucking with me in this house. So it's time to put up or shut up. They know that I'm a threat. I'm out here, I'm gonna put my best effort in. If I don't make it, good luck to everybody else who I did have an alliance with, but I expect to be back soon. I don't respect his game at all because he waited till he had some type of safety, but he's not safe. That's the thing. He's crazy. He literally put his leg up and started talking to everybody, started exposing people's game when he never got told anyone's game. He was never in no one's alliance. He was just a rat. He's a fucking rat. So it's time to kill. It's time to, it's time to go hard. This competition is called Ball Busters. In the center of a 25 foot diameter circle are eight balls. Two large ones that can be used only as a shield and six touch balls. On go, each player must race to grab a ball and hit their opponent. Get hit, you're out. Leave the circle, you're out. This battle will be best two out of three. Let's begin round one. for the bullshit that's about to happen this morning. I'm, I couldn't even <laughs> sleep. I was so excited about it. I think it took me like an hour to what do you think? Sleep. What do you think is gonna stay? I don't know. I feel like, I kind of feel like Wes just because he was so angry. Like, I, I feel know. like the anger is gonna really drive him. Leave it on the field, yeah. it's time to play. Yeah. I'm like, okay. But when I heard bitch snitch ass and all that shit, I was gay. <laughs> I'm like, I couldn't even sleep last night. I was like, okay, I'm here for it. I know. But we'll see. I got a lot to do. <laughs> I think we gotta make some moves today. I'm gonna be talking to, uh, Drew wanted to talk to me and, like, for me to clarify that boy went down. Um, I haven't talked to him, like, one-on-one -on -one since day one. We gotta get good. And so I need to figure out where his head's at. I know I pissed off Drew, running around telling everybody everything because I'm trying to save my ass, which fucking worked, by the way. Yeah, he came up to me and he was like, you know, like, you know, like, you voting for Matt, like, hurts us and our, like, group that we had going on. So I think he, in his head, like, he doesn't realize how much of a target. Like, Dude, everything's, us, everything's flipped. Seeing these two guys screaming at each other who, like, I don't want to go against in a challenge was amazing because they seemed like they were going to be out for blood and I needed one of them gone because neither one of them talks to me. We did to help survive them and try to pick them up. We got to be on every time you said survive. Erica, Cameron, and I, we slept in the same room last night. And so then this morning, Erica comes along, hey, let's run this show. We're running this whole thing. Like we have branches. We're actually connected to every single person here. So like, let's all get on board and let's run this show. Let's keep the big guys as shields. And so obviously I'm like, oh sure, that sounds great. Yeah. Players can't know about us. Uh -huh. So you can tell them we'll come in and meet you have your people. Exactly. I did write off girls things in the beginning, but when you kind of find your people, they become your people. And I feel very okay with them. Oh yeah, the road to... Ooh, let's go. <laughs> okay, all right. Okay. So we have a three-person alliance, and right after that happens... Me and you though. Yeah, for sure. Yes. Yes. I genuinely am interested in working with Cameron. Yeah, we're definitely gonna blindside Erica. Like the time's going to come. We're gonna blindside her. I think this is the exact player that I needed. We are vibing. Do you like Erica? And I'm like, I mean, don't really trust her. I know a lot of stuff's going on in that head. And Tori's like, yeah, no. 
um, not about it. And I'm like, perfect, let's get her out as soon as we can. <laughs> Thank you. You get an egg, you get an egg, you get an egg. You get an egg. This morning, first thing I wanted to do was talk to Kristen. Her and I, we've been talking a little bit, we're on good terms. Um, she asked me yesterday during the round if anyone called her name out, and I said no. I actually forgot that Kevin did call her name out. I'm all about ELE right now. Everybody love everybody. Kristen, yeah, me too. Hmm? Kristen, she's desperate. She was like, well, if you don't vote me, I won't vote you next round. And I was like, anybody could say that. So I pulled her aside and I let her know that Kevin called her name out. Hopefully that sort of gets her to owe me one and she knows that I have her back because I'm being honest with her. And that is the truth. I do want to be honest with her. That was, that was like, that was the only person. Yeah. That I just wanted to let you know. Okay, cool. I'm not, I'm not here. I know, I know. Everybody just snap judges me. Everybody's like, oh, what do you want to do? And then the second I do it, because I'm, I look like this, everybody's like, so. That was it, but yeah, I just want to let you know that. I was like laying in bed, like, I have to call Kristen. Of course, of course. Yeah, okay, thank you, thank you. Good morning, contestants. It's time for the twist ceremony. Please get dressed and head to the backyard. I'm really not wanting, obviously, fucking Kevin to go home because then I'm gonna lose my two strongest allies in this game in Matt and Kevin. I honestly don't really care if either of them come back, but I do kind of know that Kevin has a few more connections in the house, a little more social capital than Jay West might have. So I kind of want the more crazy person to come back. I'm hoping for Jay West. <sighs> Kevin, Kevin, Kevin. So I was literally praying. I didn't sleep last night because I was literally thinking, please, 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 please. Little llama, come back, come back. Um, so I, I've been up for 30 hours because I literally couldn't sleep last night. That was the most intense thing I've ever seen in my life. So I think it was haunting me in my awake state of mind. It's time to welcome back the battle match winner. I did not want to see the person running out, so I personally was like, I want to turn around because I'm so nervous if Jordan comes back. I think we're cool, but I obviously have a way bigger ally in Kevin. Fuck Jay West! Let's go! Let's go! Never disrespect my character. Calling me a puss ass bitch in front of everybody was one of the lowest things you could do. Very excited to know that fucking A and K can still go all the way. I really wish you would have lost though because your feet kind of start to stink. They do, really bad. All right. Let's talk what the fuck happened last night. J West disrespected me and diminished my character. Nobody's gonna come at me, call me a little bitch. Then he goes into, you're a fucking spy. I'm not a spy, it's you guys who need to check your alliances because people are talking. That's how I get my information. Right when Jay West called me out, my heart just was going ba-boom, ba-boom, ba-boom. I was excited for it though, too. Look. What'd I say? I was gonna come back into that house. I'm here to win, I'm here to fight. Don't fuck with me. Oh, fuck. <laughs> but at the end of the day, Jay West screwed himself over by picking me. I know I'm a target now, and I know I have loyal alliances, and there are people in this group I want to work with. And there are people who I think are floating by, and I'm definitely out for blood, and I'm definitely getting 
people who are not playing the game. I'm not here to run the house. Whoever said I'm running the house, I'm not. I'm playing the damn game. So if you think I'm not serious, come at me. Let's do another battle match. I'm hyped up. I'm happy. Let's go. Let's have a good day. All extra. He was being so extra. So extra. I was so annoyed. Oh, it's mayhem now. It's mayhem. It's not dimps anymore. It's mayhem. It's mayhem. I went up for the battle match and now I'm back. They're not fucking getting rid of me. It's no more Mr. Nice Guy, Mr. Smiles to everybody. It's mayhem. It's I want to cause chaos between these people. I want them to know that I'm not fucking around. And if they want to advance, they have to be on my side. I knew it was going to happen. I knew it was going to be put up. I, had no, I, I did not think, I, <laughs> I was did about not, to say, I don't know. I did not I didn't, think you were going to be put up. <laughs> no, Matt went against his word. So we'll go for Thomas. You keep us clear of battles. Sure. Deal. Are you going to keep that deal, though? Like man to man, woman you're, to man? You're saying that if I vote for Thomas, Thomas I'm, I'm okay. not throwing y'all up for the battle match. Correct. 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 Yeah, I have no problem with that. Cool. You think? Two heads are better than one, contestants. Loyalties shift and change at the drop of the hat. But somehow, amidst the chaos, you must find someone to trust. However, that trust could be the thing to take both of you down. This round, your fate will be directly tied to another player. Vote together, battle together, get voted out together. Can you put your ego aside and work as a team or suffer from the consequences? Good luck, Sequesterbot. This competition is called Buddy System. This round of players will be divided into eight pairs. The pairs will be assigned to Brandon. The entire round the pairs will strategize together, vote together, and be voted out together. The pair eliminated will get to choose any other pair they want to battle against to try and stay. It's time to play. Buddy system. Initially, I wasn't really sure who I wanted to be partnered up with. I just wanted to make sure that all of my allies were kind of in different pairs to benefit myself in the vote. Like, yeah, do we pick ourselves? Or just like, this is who you're going to work with? It's got to be you. It's got to be you. The team twist gets explained, and I'm thinking, this is actually pretty good because I have a few allies that are girls that are weaker that I'm hoping just get chained to some other players that I don't like. If they get voted out because people sort of perceive them as a weak challenge, then they definitely wouldn't pull me into the battle match. Let's begin the picking. Jessica, you're up first. I'm not happy. I don't want to rely on anybody for my game, so I'm disappointed and I'm worried and I just really hope I'm going to get a good player. Anyone but Ty or Brayden. I've been playing this game trying to bring as much cannon fodder along with me and I fucking roll up and I open up my color and it's Dina. Fuck. Okay, I think Hunter and I are kind of playing a similar game. I don't think he's really on anyone's radar. I don't think I'm really on anyone's radar. She was probably the one that I had the, the weakest connection with, so I was pretty uh, excited to get to work with her this round to hopefully build and stronger that connection. <laughs> oh. 
We're both over six feet tall and we have athletic builds. I'm not super worried about anybody picking us to go into a battle match, no matter how bad they don't like us. Girl power, baby. I'm gonna just put this on, smile along with her, and squeeze myself into an alliance and get myself back in this game. I feel like everyone loves her. I'm very happy to see that I picked her color. Holy shit, like teaming up with somebody? Fuck, it can go either like really well or really bad really fast. Money. Heck yeah. I see myself as like a huge female threat in the house and then obviously Drew's been in an elimination. We're too intimidating, like why would we why would they throw us in right now? I was pissed when I didn't get Erica because she's probably one of my strongest alliances in this competition, but it gave me an opportunity to kind of work Kristen as a pawn because she knows that I'm controlling stuff. It was a double-edged sword because on one hand, he's strong, he intimidates people, but on the other hand, he's fucking loud. He just came back and he rubs people the wrong way, so. And he has completely different allies than me, so I'm like, are we gonna agree? I don't know. <laughs> Me and Dina are the weakest team by far. Like you just look at us and you look at the height difference of all the other teams and I'm like, oh shit. <laughs> oh fuck. I haven't talked about it though. Okay. Because like, I'm with Kevin. I don't want to talk about it. I don't want to talk about it. I don't want to talk about it. I'm going to get with my partner and we're going to decide who we want to vote. Okay. I'm not going to listen to what everyone else wants to do. Okay. 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 I need to make two big moves before jury happens. I need to get Jayla and Drew out. I see the way that she works, and she's a very, very smart girl. And I know that she has some of the other like girls that really aren't doing much. We can like each other after. Yeah. Like Dina sure. has, Dina has to go. Because oh, thinking like so big, tied. Yeah. yeah, yeah, maybe. Yeah, yeah and I feel like I mean, this is really simple, honestly. And then I got big. <laughs> I just want Jayla out and I don't want her to know that I'm behind it at all because I know she's she's a fighter and she's a good player, which is a compliment to her. I just don't want her in the game anymore. Take on it? Yeah, I'm down with it. Okay, cool. All right, come on. Let's, Let's talk to other people. Show our boobs. <laughs> I trust them. We're saying we're gonna do Brayden and Dina. And we walk out of the room and Brayden's standing there. And he's like, so you think I'm weak? And we're all like, <laughs> no. Just so you guys want to pick us because we're weak. I'm not picking you. Is that what the vote was? That's what you were saying. Who said that? I'm just curious because you guys aren't telling me what people said. Well, we haven't made a decision yet. Okay. okay. That's what I'm asking you. Um, I mean, the thing is, like, I guess it doesn't really matter if you guys voted Drew and, and what's your nuts. They would just choose us anyway, so. Why? Because we're clearly Wait, the weakest. Team. Well, you didn't prove yourself to be weak. But That's, yeah. It's all game. It's all love. So I gotta do what I gotta do. Okay. What about like? What about saving them just in case like we need to pick them for the battle? Well, yeah. What are you thinking? I don't know yet, that's what I'm asking. I'm going for Dana and the one dude. I don't why, even care. Why then? Because they're weak and I'm not getting put up again. And if I get put up again, You've been through enough shit, so I'm not I'm putting them, I'm putting them up because I'm, I'm pissed at Dina. She'd be talking shit. But with Dina putting my name out there saying that I'm apparently running the show, it's skeping me out. I don't mind running the show, but she's got to shut up. I want you and me to decide who we're gonna vote. Yes. Not listen to anyone else. 
My plan was to get Christine aside and we don't have to tell anyone shit and everyone can come up to us and talk to us, but we never give a name and we just agree to whatever everyone else is saying. So we decide who we want now and yeah. we don't tell anyone else. Okay, well, what are you thinking? Then we might not get picked because they're not yeah. going to know who we voted. Yeah. We just who are you thinking? Shut our mouths. Yeah, you're right. Talk to us. you're right. You're right. So who I are you agree thinking? with you. Okay, time's ticking. Ring, ring, Ty, what's going on? Tell me what you're thinking. He's just kind of like, um, I don't know, um, so, I don't know. So I heard from the grapevine of Thomas that Dina was talking to him, Matt, and Jay West, how I'm running the house. You know what? I'm, hey, I'm gonna put it out there too. My boy, they're they're trying to get me to turn on you so if I get picked. Oh, who, is they? who is they? Who is they? Oh, sorry. You're running, hey, uh, you said you were running the house. Wait, oh, oh, you ain't running me. I am not running no damn house. <laughs> She's telling me that we're cool and that I shouldn't be worried with her and she shouldn't be worried with me, but the circumstances seem to have changed. She's got to go. And who said it? I promise you, you But I apparently I was saying that Kevin was the biggest threat in the house and was running it. So at that point, as soon as he called my name, I knew that everyone was gonna latch on to. I said some shit and I was the reason that Kevin like I'll listen to you and I'll take it into consideration. I promise you. I'm not getting a fucking break in this game. Everything is not going my way. The only two people we're not aligned with are Dina and Brayden and Jayla and Dustin. I, I don't I saw them in your room. You, What's your feeling about this? I had no qualms with anybody wanting to vote us in because, I mean, I know that me and Erica can take anybody out in this game. Do you want to fight Yeah, I'm fighting Conquer. So we're, we're going to fight Conquer. So we're going to So collectively, we decided that we were going to vote for Dina and Brayden. We're not aligned with them, so for, to us, it's worth who do you think? Who do you think? Okay. No, it doesn't matter. No, it doesn't matter. Okay. That's our best. That's our best. Yeah. Okay. No, I agree. I, okay. Like who? Other than, like I'm down for if there's somebody you really want to go after. I don't say that. I mean, you don't care. Yeah. Okay. Hello. I didn't know you had a voice there, buddy. Hey. Uh, welcome to the game. I'm so glad you came. I want Drew out. He's with Erica, though. I see this as a perfect setup. Erica and Drew, two of my targets. I'm like, okay, wonderful. This could not be set up more perfectly. Dude, I was like, good, so it's like, I go to the guy, get information from. Okay, so you like, like that. Um, like, okay. yeah, it's something I want to keep on a little bit. Cool. I mean, I get a lot of intel from Drew, and I'm like, what intel? Like, that guy doesn't have any real connections, as far as I'm concerned. I mean, I think an easy vote then is gonna be, um, um, Brayton and Dina, so. Drew's one of the people like I will secretly come and talk to. He was apparently this leader of this guy's alliance that never existed, but he's the one who kind of feeds me a lot of information. Okay, let's just go wander the house, let's get names, and we'll be back here in a few minutes. He's powered with a lot of strong players, so like that's kind of my source of info. And I just, I, I threw it out there like I couldn't go after him at this time. I think he was a better ally to have. So. Let's do it. All right. Yeah. Cool. Like in my opinion, Brayden, at least Brayden and Dina are like picking a side. At least they're not afraid to show their cards. There are some people who are floating in the middle. They're not. They don't really have any fucking. Dina's fucked. I feel like Dina's fucked trying to fuck me over. I want her out. No, I'm she's not gonna. Me. She's not gonna pick me because she doesn't want me in the battle match. She's not gonna pick us. But I don't want to vote them. Well then. I genuinely. Th I don't want them gone. Are you aligned with her in any way? Me. Yes, or, it's a yes or yeah. no question. If you are, then yeah. then toss the vote on somebody else, and then yeah. let the majority of them pick her. But no, we're tossing our vote because of what you said. Yeah, but they won't pick us. If, if everybody else votes them, then like we don't get the ball on our hands. They will not pick us. I promise you. Dina. I I found it, it like interesting that my two closest allies were paired together, but at the same time, like. Dina and Brayden were instantly targeted by my partner because of that. And I had to pull him upstairs and be like, I'm not doing that. I'm gonna grab him by his fucking ball and I'm not letting him put out my two closest allies and fuck that because I know he wants them out. I'm not gonna let that happen. I'm not gonna let that happen. 
thing is like, here's the thing for all of you. You're gonna choose, if you choose us, we could choose any of you to battle back. Yeah, right. If you choose them, they're just gonna choose us to battle back. It's the smartest choose for you guys to vote. Anyways, um, around yeah, like... Well, I mean, hopefully we pull it out. I know. Okay. Dina, and your partner, come upstairs. Okay. We're fine with so when you're at the bottom, and you know that everyone's going to perceive you at the bottom, there's going to be usually two logical ways to go. The first choice is to go for power. The second is to go for chaos. Okay. He's telling me that if I don't vote for you two, you won't pick us up for the battle match because you two have an alliance of some sort. Option number one, power. Power is not going to work. People aren't going to talk to me that way. I'm deciding for option number two. I've got to create some sort of chaos and some sort of calamity. So who are we going to vote Thomas for? was in that conversation where I'm going to go yell at Hunter. So in, five minutes, in five minutes, in five minutes, we'll figure out who the pairs are, but I will not vote you. But that's what, because of what she said. Hey, everyone! Who wants to talk? I want to get someone voted out that will not choose me for the battle match. Come on in, come on in, since no one's talking to me. Who of all of these teams would possibly not choose me? Well, maybe Kristen and Kevin, but I don't think that I can actually get the votes onto them because Kristen has a lot of allies on one side, Kevin has a lot of allies on the other side. I'm thinking the only other option to try to get votes onto instead of me and Dina is to move votes over to Drew and Erica. So follow along with me here. If I just go around and say Drew and Erica, Drew and Erica, Drew and Erica, that's gonna come back around. Drew and Erica are gonna hear about it. Even if I get the votes on them, they're definitely gonna pull us into the battle match. So I think I need to get a scapegoat. I need to find a team that no one will vote for. I'm gonna call out that team, cause a little chaos, uh, find the person that's probably the biggest pussy bitch in the house and try to get the heat onto them. Uh, like if you guys vote for us, Literally any of you could go into the battle match. You know that if anyone else gets voted, they're probably just going to choose us anyways because we're perceived as the weakest. Yeah. So why would you put yourself in that risk of voting us? Just so you know, I'm going to vote for Hunter and Jess. They've been fucking playing everyone. It's fine. They're friends with everyone. Fucking cunt. But that's someone that I think I can beat in the battle match anyways. So I'm going to put my vote on them. You guys can choose to put your vote on them too. But put your vote on us. We'll take them in anyways. I'm targeting Jess and Hunter. Like, bro, I've been loyal to you. What are you doing? Or maybe one of you. I don't really know because she's my partner. I haven't asked her about yeah. this yet. He gives names. And we have not discussed this at all. He just gives two fucking names. And I didn't agree to that. And so everyone, I see their eyes change. There's, there's two LOSs out there too, so. Yeah. 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 So I know that Hunter has a lot of influence right now, and for his name to be thrown out, he's gonna go off in a little huff because he's a fucking baby that wants to have his way all the time. So the moment that he sees me look in his eyes and call it his name, he fucking goes red, flush, and he's ready to walk off in a huff. I know where my bed's going, so yeah. I'm gonna go for no less, because okay. I'm concerned about my own safety. As soon as Brayden called me out, I knew that I had to get with Dina first, and I just need to get her to convince Brayden to take the vote off of me because I don't want to end up going into a battle match. I didn't know what he was doing. I have no idea. I honestly have zero idea. I called you in a room and said, yeah. you're my person. You know, I have no idea. I don't and I thought, that I, was, I thought I was screwing my partner, but I think that I just got screwed over by my partner. I swear on my life, I don't want you to go. I get it. What? And you're, you're stronger than I me. I literally went up to town and I was like, I don't want to do Dina for And then literally, 30 seconds later. Is there anyone you can change it? Yeah, I'm... Okay, let's find time. Well, I mean, it's still your partner. Do you feel good with Brandon and Dana? He's fucking freaking out. I know it. All of a sudden, I hear Brayden yelling from the other room, who wants to talk? Who wants to talk? And I'm just like, don't look, don't look, don't look. I don't know what to do. I know my yeah, name is yeah, yeah. yeah. Everyone wanted to talk to me now. It's too fucking late. Thanks a lot. I don't think it's. I don't think if you so. guys want to. So I'm gonna tell you if I if I voted out, that means more than y'all voted me. I mean that's. And true. I'm not a bitch, I'm not so. Sure. But I mean you have to agree to a partner, and he seems pretty set. No, I don't do either. Brayden, I'm not scared of you at all. You're a little weak, 
And I see that, I see your weakness, and you're just trying to grasp for air at this point. I'm ready for you. If you wanna pick me and challenge me, bring it on, I will take you to the battlefield. If you beat me fair and square, good game. I'm not going to sit around for 20 minutes and just wait for the book. Who got together and said they were voting you? Who? Who got together? Everyone. They all, everyone even nodded their fucking heads in there. They're like, yeah, I guess we did do that. They had five. Okay, but listen, I had me some Drew, Drew and Erica. I figured that if Drew and Erica actually get voted out, they will be pissed off enough that they will feel betrayed by other people, and Drew's got too much pride to bring in the weakest team to battle him. Oh, Junior? When you did that, don't people yeah. like you and Hunter against each other. This is your Junior. Alright. No, seriously, like, listen. I'm not gonna pull you in, but, like, if you just vote Drew and Erica, you'll be fine. Alright. Let's, let's go get him and tell him we're switching our vote. That looks sketchy as fuck. It's gonna sketch everyone else okay, out. Okay, okay, we, yeah. we gotta do it secretly. Okay, well, should we, let's just do it. I think we should probably do Drew and Erica. No one's gonna do Hunter and Jess. You realize that they're probably gonna pick us and we're fucking ourselves over. The, Drew, and, Drew is the only one out there that has too much pride to choose the weakest team. Okay. I don't think anyone else out there okay. is fucking illogical if enough. We, we, that's our only chance. I just, we're gonna go against well, them, but that's listen, fine. Or that's we're fine. voted in. Yeah. Drew's a fucking beast, and I'm like, little old me. So like, I'm terrified that he's gonna pretty much dominate that, and I, I was mad at my partner for wanting to do that and put us in that predicament, because he's convinced that Drew has such a you know big ego that he's like, no, I'm not gonna pick the, the weak, uh, weakest links. I'm gonna pick somebody who fucking screwed me over. But obviously everyone was, that was saying they were gonna vote them knows the smartest thing to do is to pick the weakest people if you wanna stay in the game. And I feel like together we are the weakest team. This would be, it's too early. It's yeah. too early for that. Is he with it? He's with Erica. And Erica's yeah. a good chatter. Just, you know, we have nothing but time here sometimes and I've just worked out all the numbers and in a perfect world, uh, Drew's going out next. She kind of threw you. I like her. I I like her, but I think Drew's gonna get the best. He's in the best for the Wait, oh shit, we only have two teams here. Yeah, him? Yeah, then we're here. He's in. Thomas has now completely flipped on whatever alliance he had. He's now with me and Tori, like, 100%. I mean, we're oh, in it. I talked to Erica, but like, I can't tell when she's ruined on. So we're gonna make a move eventually, but right now not fine. Okay, so we're going with... Yeah. I think we go with Tori right now. But the thing is, we lose two numbers. We lose two numbers. So, but it but but it solidifies and it's right. So Dina and I I look at it, but I mean, you think you guys just look at all the other people I don't know how to work with us. Who? Yeah, all the other hard players. Like Dina will work with us in a heartbeat. People are just wanting to get out easy targets, even though I was wanting to make a big move. I mean, I will see. I talked to Zach and he wasn't he wasn't about it, so he's my partner. I can't go against him. I'm not voting for. Dina and Braden because Kristen was like, don't do it. Um, I was able to catch up with Kevin. We had a good talk. Needed to reestablish and let him know that I kept things 103 and that uh, we're making it to the end. So I feel like that's going to be my final two. Um, Alliance right there, it, it, he's my roommate. It makes sense. I uh, Don't fuck me because I will beat your ass. People that have come up to me. I've been sticking to, and I really think that we can fucking take a hold of this game if we continue yeah, to do that. Both can, but we we show it a lot. We are showing it a lot. But still, we need to split, yeah, but, right. but we're yeah. solid. Yeah, always. Okay. okay. Room together. Okay. okay. All right. We had that conversation. They wanted about what else. Yeah. I'm open to it. Yeah. yeah. He said they're probably big fans. Yeah. Okay. Um, okay. Ty, and who? Everyone has a plan. Yeah. I wouldn't tell me he's going for, but he said it's not you guys. He swore it's not you guys. <laughs> Okay, that's all I need to know. So I think we have enough votes for Jamaica. I think you guys are good. Okay. Yeah. They're probably going to choose. I know I, that's what's like, annoying, well, but Drew, it'll frazzle them. Drew is the one that initially, like, I saw him go talk to people about voting me. 
of being in the first place. So what I wanted to do was just like, so why is that me? Because why would I, if I just yeah. see them, then they're like, we're going to take you. Yeah. I need them to be uh, like confused, yeah. but the thing is like, I don't know. I also just like the fun that. I, I've been wanting to get big targets out from the start. I wanted to get Kevin out. I would love to get Drew out. I don't know why we wouldn't take this opportunity to get Drew and Erica out, two of the biggest targets. Are you sure? Yeah. Okay. I'm, I'm gonna go confirm. Go okay. confirm. But I'm gonna go confirm. confirm. Yeah, yeah. We, we gotta cut a deal because you know I'm in no man's land right now. So. Thomas doesn't know when to shut the fuck up. You can't keep a secret with Thomas. That's why the whole alliance went to shit. The only problem I have is I know you like to keep your mouth open a little bit. The only reason I, I do keep my mouth open. Thomas and I are cool right now. I can use him as a pawn. I need him for a vote. We'll see where that takes us. Like, I will never play the sketch game. Whatever happens, I'm gonna let it all go. That was like the best move for me to be vulnerable and open myself up so that people would want to grab me. Damage control consisted of a little bit of manipulation and at the same time, a lot of honesty. I am on the bottom because I exposed myself last game, so I'm vulnerable. I know this, and I want to keep it that way. Because I think Brayden and Jake, they're going in either way, I think. But I still think we should do Jimmy Erica and Chris I don't trust anyone. No one will look me into the eye. No one's looking at me at all, and they're all being sketchy. I guess the snakes and rats broke out of their cages because I'm not feeling so safe anymore. No one would even look me in the eye. They're, I think they might have booked us too. Just could be paranoid, but if so, we're in a battle match either way. Okay, so. but who, should, who are you doing? Junior Cup? Okay. Contestants, it's time for the elimination vote. One of you will be eliminated, and then select two people for the battle match. I hope you strategized wisely. Braden and and Dina, they wouldn't make eye contact with me, um, and it seemed like they were avoiding me. So I just had a bad feeling about them. I know I can probably work well with Dina, so even if I am voted out, I know that there's still some options there to choose. However, I'm still trying to flip the vote because I want to hopefully get it on Drew and Erica. Results. The team eliminated is Brayden and Dina. But this means you get to decide who we go against. Yep. I don't care about alliances, I don't care about friendships. Fuck everyone, they put us up here. You pick who we can beat. I will literally pop a tit to win this. So why, come on. Why don't we do um why don't we do Ty and Christine? I know that they're probably really good, but like, okay. I Fuck think it. everyone else is too strong of like a, a male okay. uh, on their team. Sounds good. I think both of us are sad that you guys threw votes on us. Um, we expected to go in because, you know, I would say that between us, we're probably the weakest of the couples. You guys all look pretty strong, so we expected to, you know, go in either being voted or being, like, thrown in a, into a battle match. Um, People were really quick to fucking throw everyone under the bus, as per usual. Um, we're going to do Ty and Christine. I'm so sorry. I really like you guys. Dude, thanks for having a backbone. There's all these teams here. None of them want to see you come back. You're choosing the weak route right now. Yep. No one's going to respect you when you come back. No one. It's a new round every round. They know you don't have a backbone now. They're just gonna keep going after you until you're gone. Okay. I had your back. Then how come we're up here? I had no fucking part of that. Bigger threats in the house. If you 
thought the game ended after you're out. Guess again. For those of you who are new to Sequester, once the first 10 people are eliminated there will be a competition for one person to get back in the game. Last year, the competition was Circle, a social elimination game that required allegiances with other players to get ahead. This year the pre-jury is scheming to prepare themselves. want someone to blow up the game. Like... She ain't blowing up shit on me. And I'm using his emotional vulnerability to get more information so when I do battle back, I'm gonna totally go in and blow up the house just like he wants. If you're not in here conversating with us, what's the point of being in here? He's my eyes, I'm his ears. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> hey guys, can I just talk to you for two seconds? Um, so, I know you're probably thinking like I'm just trying to avoid you guys and not talk to you guys and just kind of want to be alone. You know I'm not feeling great, um, so that's part of it. You guys were in alliance already, and I knew that I wasn't going to get anywhere with you guys, and you're very set in your ways. I'll go back downstairs. You want some help? No, Frank? I'm good, thank you. I love her. It's my future wife right there. Oh. <laughs> I love a little crazy. I'm not crazy. gonna say what I was gonna say. I love a little crazy. There. I love a little crazy, yo. <laughs> what are you laughing about? You don't have anything to save there, Barbie. Calm down. <laughs> that supposed to be an insult? Yeah, it is actually. Yeah, it feels like a compliment. What are you, 18? 22, thank Close you. Close enough. Okay. You're you got back. you got nothing yeah, in your really head, is. so don't worry she about really it. Is. Okay. I'm not you have nothing number. in my head. Really? Okay. Tell me your game. Why? I'm not even telling so you so nothing you can, because so you, you don't have up. anything. You oh, never had a game. This one's talking too much. You're not talking at all because you have nothing and you've spilled everything. Oh, spilled okay. Everything. You're right. Yeah. You know, this everything. is pre-jury. A lot of people like to, you know, Talk it out. Well, you exactly. start the, the mood. person who's going to come started in. the mood. No, you I started are, the you mood. Yeah, I think you started weird. the mood by really? picking me. Do you want to know why I picked you? Do you want to know why? Oh, are you going to now tell me why you picked me? Yeah. Because you don't know the game. Really? Because you thought you was going to go at it. There's a guy's alliance, and you're mad that I didn't pick the guy's alliance. And I also know that you your alliance, so I wanted one of each of you. That's the wrong alliance. And I knew that you would lose, and I would have a better chance at anything physical against you. Take your no game back where it belongs. Hopefully Matt can agree with you like he agreed with me. You yeah, know, maybe. Damn, why you stir this pot up? You're the one. Why'd why you stir you this pot up? This? That dumbass girl downstairs don't want to talk to nobody. She's stupid. She don't know nothing. Who said that? You. No, I didn't. Really? I said you're putting a target on your back not to wanting to be a part of this game. Like, what are you talking about? I never said dumbass girl. Please. Only time I said a cuss word to you is shut the hell up right there. Shut or shut the, the fuck, fuck up. up yeah. actually. Well, shut the fuck up again, please. Your memory is terrible. It is terrible, but I'm still telling you the same Boom. exact shit you're telling me. Because I remember everything you told me. So? Like, I don't know how you did it for that day like this. It was very hard. I know it. Around me, fuck off. Fuck off. Clearly around you enough for you to somehow pick me and then cry about it. I'm so sorry. Because I'm trying to manage you. Well, you did a great job. Yeah. I don't think you're batshit at all. Bye. Bye, babe. Bye, babe. Hope you get your shower and get your makeup fixed, too. You look terrible, and your weave is awful. Oh, I know. It's so bad. It is. I can see it from here, your tracks. Good.